So on your robot, most first Lego League robots will have two driving wheels. They have two motors, each one driving the wheel. That makes it Lego. You want those to have good traction. So you want the tire on those, because you want those to be on the map. But you don't want a robot with just two wheels. Some other point has to be touching the map. And so whatever you use for that other point, you typically want it to be able to slip, to be able to slide easily so your robot can turn. Um, the best example is to like pull up this robot here. So this one, you see we've got the two driving wheels, and there's two other support wheels here. So these support wheels have the rubber tires on them, which means when this robot tries to turn, what is happening with these wheels? Are they going in the direction of the wheel? They're going side to side. But the rubber prevents that. The rubber makes that hard to do, so that means the robot will have trouble turning. So what you want instead is something that slides easier. And one solution that Dr. Barry just gave is take the tires off, leave just the rims. The rims are made of a hard plastic, and they will slide well on this year's task. So you can take off the tires. There's other solutions as well, but that's just one.